Hello everybody, I am Jedi Jack Penguin and welcome back to another LEGO Brickheads review. So today we're going to be looking at set number 40422, Frankenstein. This set includes 108 pieces and originally retailed for $9.99 when it released late September of 2020. Now, I got this set last year around the time that it released. I believe I got this for Black Friday just to get through the promo threshold. Another really cool thing to note about this Brickhead set is that it is licensed by Universal Monsters, which I thought was really, really cool that they did this. I was expecting them to do something again this year, but it doesn't look like that's the case. You can take a look at the side art for this. I really love that we get that Universal Monsters logo and then like the Universal Monsters Frankenstein represented with this more graphic style from the side. Really nice orange box art right there mixing with the black that you typically see for these Brickhead sets from the seasonal line. From the very back you get your standalone look for this particular character and also this is number 111 in the Brickheads line if you were interested. So without a further ado, let's open this up and take a look at what's inside. Looking at the box contents, you get a total of three unnumbered bags to build the set, in addition to your loose plate piece for the stand and your instruction manual. Taking a quick look at the instructions, we mimic the front of the box. From the very back, you get your win guy, get your piece count for two pages right there leading on to the final overall model no other advertisements because there really wasn't anything else to show and that brings us to our final overall model of frankenstein's monster who looks really nice in this sort of black and white using the light gray dark gray black for the entire character and a little bit of silver and very nice touch by lego there we also get quite a few printed pieces on this character which is really great for the time period, we get one from the very front of this wall element for his outfit. We also get a new eye print for his character using these curved one by ones instead of the typical circular ones, just so then you add that little bit of extra eyelid at the top. I think that looks very nice for his character, as well as a print from the very top of his forehead right there on this two by four tile piece. Now, another thing that I thought I'd mention is the fact that this character has a taller head than a lot of other typical Brickheads characters. Like for instance, bringing in Yuzi Una, we can take a quick size comparison between these characters just to see the size of how big his head is in comparison to like a normal Brickheads. Additionally, something that I thought I'd mention is the fact that we use these silver studs from the very side for like those electric charge areas. I'm not 100% sure what those are, but that's at least what I remember them being from the original Frankenstein story. We also get the clip pieces from the side for his hands, and we also get the hair pretty much showing studs all around and a little bit of tiled off from the back. No back prints there, but overall I think that LEGO did a very nice job with this character, and you also get one of your typical Brickheads plate pieces. So overall, for another $10 Brickhead set, I think this one features quite a lot of value in terms of the new and exclusive printed pieces. As unuseful as most of these would be outside of the situation, I think they work very well to create the character. I also think the color scheme was a great decision as opposed to making it in color. I think this relates more to the original Frankenstein movie, which is an added bonus for fans of that. And this is yet another fun Halloween build to add to your collection. So yeah, that's pretty much all that I have to say for this video. Leave your thoughts down in the comment section below what your thoughts are on this set. Also remember to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon so every time I upload a new video. So yeah, that's it for now and happy Halloween. Bye!